Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Aries? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, whenever you come across this reading. I hope everyone is staying safe. How are y'all feeling? I love you guys. To new viewers, cross watchers, come on in. Take what resonates, leave the rest for someone else. Reverse the roles, how they fit in your life. I don't know your life, okay? So you're going to have to reverse the roles. I need you to stay with me. There are lessons, blessings, and confirmations in all of my readings. So, um, I'm not going to hold you long, okay? So let's see what's going on in you. Let's see what's going on with you, Aries. Spirit, guides, divine universe, as you give me clarity, understanding. Most of all, I need your divine. I need your protection, okay? Let's see what's going on in your energy. Mm. Mm. Okay. Okay, Aries. Ooh, ooh, you are fed up. You are fed up. You are fed up. Mm, mm. You are fed up. You are fed up. So, Aries, uh, <laughs> so what we got here, we got the we got the five of pentacles. We got the eight of cups here. Okay, you fed up. I mean, this is double walking out. This is double, you know, leaving this person out in the cold. This is like you are you are fed up, okay? You got the queen of swords and you got the intuition. You're tired of the BS. You are fed up. Your, your intuition been telling you, you you on point with what you're feeling. You're on point with how you're feeling. And so this person wants to come in with an apology. But I see your chin is so far up, Aries, that you're like, I, I, I don't want it. I don't want your I don't want your investment now. When I wanted your investment, you didn't give it to me. When I when you when you should have invested in me, you didn't give it to me. And I mean, when I see this card, I, I'm pulling strong energy where your head is up. Like, I don't want your cup. I don't want your apology. I don't want your investment. It's like you are fed up with this person. You hear me? Yes. You left this person out in cold. Could be a uh, could be an earth sign, could be a water sign, could be an air sign. But you said, I don't want your apology. OK, you say, no, thank you. I don't want it. I don't want it. Keep it. Keep your apology. I don't want it. I'm tired of the BS. You know, um, I'm listening to my intuition and you, you left this person. You left this person out in the cold. You walked away from it. You fed up with the BS. Okay. You going towards your wish fulfillment. You tired of the drama. You tired of the conflict. You're tired of it. You know what I'm saying? This person looks at your pictures. Uh, yeah, you you definitely you definitely had it. You done. You closing that door. I don't know who you are, but you closed that door. That, yeah, this person is definitely manipulating. Very manipulating. Mm-hmm. Yeah, very manip manipulating. And so you your light bulb has came on about this person, and you ten toes down. You going towards your destiny. You have shut that door. You going towards your happiness. Yeah, you definitely, the wheel is starting to turn ever since you shut the door on this, this connection or whatever. I feel like this person, whoever he or she was, they were definitely taking you for granted. It was like, it was like just so much drama and conflict. Okay. And you're going towards your 10 of pentacles. Okay. You're going towards a lifelong part and you're going towards your happiness. You're going towards whatever makes you happy. You're going to, you're going towards someone that's wants to be in, you know, with you for for long term, you know what I'm saying? But this person don't want it to be over, okay? They stressed out. He or she stressed out, Aries. Could be an earth sign. Could be an earth, I mean, I'm sorry. Yeah, it could be an earth sign, but this could be a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, okay? Yeah, you definitely going to, yeah, look at here. Look at here. Look at there. The tower done come down. Oh, my goodness, my goodness. The tower done came down on this person. Oh, yeah. This person is stuck. This person is stuck. They're stuck. They're feeling this wrath, honey. They in isolation. They feeling this wrath. Do you hear me? They in isolation. They're not taking this. They, for some reason, this person thought, you thought, this person thought that he or she would get another chance with you. 
They, he or she thought they was going to get another chance with you. And baby, when I tell you, you said the lies have caught up with you. This is someone you could have been codependent with or they were codependent on you. Uh, this could have been someone that you had. Um, it could be a strong Capricorn in here. I also see it intuitively. I see a Gemini. But this person could have been uh, verbal abusive. So for some of you, physical abusive. But you could have been codependent, meaning you had a child together. You had, uh, you know, something like that, like, or you had you, you, something that held y'all together and you just, you just got, so well, you just got tired of it. So now it's like, boom. Okay. It's like, boom, the tower done came down. That means that, uh, yeah, drastic, something drastic has happened to this person. Um, and I feel like, uh, I feel, I really feel what spirit guys is showing me is that this person this person, whatever he or she was codependent on you for Aries, this person is feeling it. When I tell you, you shook the foundation up. I feel like you shook the foundation up. Okay. You shook it up when you walked down and left and, and shut the door because the door is shut because you got the world card is here. Okay. Out with the old, in with the new. A lot of good things are happening for you. A lot of wish fulfillments are happening for you. You're happy. I feel like some of you must have come into some money as well. Uh, your money is right. Some of you uh, create generation wealth or a payout. <clears throat> some of you got a settlement and everything. And I feel like this person was using you before. And they thought that they was going to get a piece of your pie this time but you had a trick for them this time and that's why i feel like the codependent because they lie a lot of lies and hiding things and stealing cheating cheating on you and this person thought that they was gonna get a piece of your pie and they end up that uh 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 uh, uh nope you slammed that door so fast you slammed the door and throw it away the key now the tower is here which tells me that this person there that yeah i know y'all know what this is right yeah they going through hell right now. For some of them, uh, for some of you, they could be out in the cold now. I feel like once, uh, this is what Spirit Guides is showing me. Once you, um, um, once y'all lease was up, you moved out, you left this person. Your lease was coming up and you, 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 you know, you left. For some of you, you just totally left this person out in the cold. Because you got tired of this he or she. He or she, y'all, when I say they, I mean he or she. You got tired of them using you. You got tired of the cheating, the lies and stuff. So this person is stuck. Okay. They're stuck in a situation and it's like it has, the tower has came down on this person. That means that the tower, that means that this person, they had, uh, uh, their foundation, yeah, was shook to the core. That means that either they don't have anywhere to go. Okay. They have nowhere to go. And you say, that ain't my problem. I'm, I'm taking, you know, I'm going on because I'm tired of the BS. I'm tired of this. I'm tired of the conflict, the drama. I'm always hearing about he or she doing something with somebody or it's always some some mess. And you said, I'm tired of it. This time you had a different plan. Any other time they come in with an apology. I'm sorry. I'm going to do better. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. But huh, 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 no, this time you said, I'm done. I'm done with your manipulation. I don't peep how you play. You see what I'm saying? They're dealing with a high priestess. You are a high priestess, whoever you are. You said, I'm done with the manipulation. I'm done with the lies. I'm done with how you try to use me. How you try to use me. And this person don't want it to be over. They're stressed out, honey. They are stressed out, ma'am, sir, whoever you are. They are stressed out. You hear me? They're stressed out because they, the, the, the walls has come tumbling down on them. Okay. They're stuck. The walls don't come down and you could care less. You said, I don't care. You don't use me too long. You have used me too long. And I feel like you said, I am done. I'm fed up. I'm fed up. Extra fed up. Extra, extra. I feel like you really, really when I tell you, you was fed up. You fed up. Now, this could be, this may have already happened for some of you because everybody are, are, are on different timelines. So for some of you, this may have already happened. Some of you, this is about to happen. Some of you, this is in your near future. Okay. So it, it just tells me that you just really said, I'm done. I'm fed up with this. And you, you start, you took, you took a leap of faith somewhere else. 
you know, starting something somewhere else. Your chin is up. You got your dog. You got your cat and you moving on because you started peeping. You started getting in tune with yourself and listening to your intuition. You realize <laughs> he been manipulating me. He been playing me all this time. And I wasn't woke at the time. But you said, oh, oh I'm woke now. So you can keep your apologies. This person wants to come in and invest and wants to wants to apologize to you because he or she don't want it to be over. You say, keep your apology. Keep your apology. OK, they're stressed out because something has happened. Something has happened. Look at that. Something has ha has happened. They in isolation. Something has happened. You say, well, I'm going towards my wish fulfillment. A lot of good things are happening for you. Like I said, you got 1010. You got the sun card is here. I look at the card. Sun card is 10 as well. Okay. A lot of good things. Every, a lot of things. Will is turning in your favor. A lot of good things. You getting your good karma because this person just literally for a lot of years, for a lot of years, for some of you, eight plus years, this person lied and was very deceiving and was very codependent. And but you back on your feet. You see that you back in control, ten toes down. But this person was very go to codependent. I, I feel like this person didn't think you was going to ever, ever leave them. They have pulled this mess so much till, you know, you said, I. that's it. That's it. Tell me more spirit guys for Aries. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Look at that. Now it came out in the reverse, the Knight of Wands. They don't want to play no more. They don't want to be a no player no more because it came out in the reverse. You say it's too late. It's too late. Now look at them. Look at them right now. Yeah. Now they want to come in. They don't want to be a player. It's too late. <laughs> it is too late. That's because they have no stability. They don't lost a job. <gasps> this person that lost a job. That's what it is. That's what has hit them, Aries. This person done lost a job. Didn't I tell you their foundation was shook up? Look at here. This person done lost their job. Mm -hmm. No stability. No stability. Oh, yeah, honey. Oh, yeah. When you left, the whole foundation shook up. But you protecting yourself and your territory. This person was very selfish. You know what I'm saying? You, you, you tried to be good to this person. You was there for this person. And this person just, just took you and just, just took you for granted. Very selfish. In and out. Didn't care how they talked to you. Didn't care what they said to you. Just a lot of stuff. A lot of mess. A lot of drama they kept. And you... you <laughs> yeah, Aries. You, you know, that part. Let's see what spirit guys... What else spirit guys got for you. Yeah, this person that lost a job, everything is coming down on this person. But you are getting your good karma because you was you was you was good to this person. Whoever he or she was, you were good to them. Have faith. It says have faith. Okay. Aries. And let me put my glasses on. It says, um, it's not always easy to have faith and trust that everything is going to be OK. Yet still, you must do exactly that, because when you have faith, your life will begin to flow in magical ways that you never imagined were possible. Just continue to have faith, baby, because right here, the way the cards are showing me, you got a lot of beautiful things coming that's destined for you. You got a lot of happiness. And I feel like it's some of you coming into some money, you about to get a payout. You you know, it's destined for you. A lot of a lot of sunshine, a lot of happiness. And now this person wants to come in and apologize. Yeah, because they don't they don't their foundation has been shook. Thank you, spirit guys. Tell me more. <clears throat> let go. That's right. Excuse me. Let go. Absolutely. Let go. Have faith. What spirit guys are saying. Let go. A lot of you did let go. A lot of you put left this person and walked away from this person. Ever since you walked away from this person, this person probably done got, you know, had, you know, he, he or she must have thought you was going to sign another lease with them or going to stay with them again. But you, you, you came out of that. Now this person have nowhere to go. Okay, now this person's out in the cold. And ever since you walked away from this person, you have been, you, your life is being fulfilled, okay? You, the wheel is turning in your favor. Things are destined for you. And Spirit Guides is saying, have faith and let go. For some of you, 
that's having a hard time letting go. It says you've been asked to let go of whatever pain and resentment you've been holding on to. It's hurting you and you can't fully be present in, in your life if you're looking, if you're holding on to holding on to this negativity. Release it and release it and you will you you be free. Release it and you'll be free. So, yeah, I feel like a lot of you are already in that energy that you feel free. You feel good. But this person's going through it. They're going through it. Spirit guys, tell me one more card. One more card for Aries. One more card. Thank you. Yeah, this person is definitely. Yep, look at that. Break free. Break free, baby. And a lot of you have broken free. Break free. Yes, indeed. Yes, it says you're being asked to break free from the tribe in order to live your authentic life. This isn't easy, but it's very necessary. If you're going to share your true self with others, be brave, be real, be you. And trust that those who love you will always be there for you. Break free, honey. Let it go. A lot of you have let it go. You let that go. And now, because of that, this person is going through major, a major, yeah, they, they, the, their foundation is being shook. They left out in cold. Like I say, we don't wish nothing bad on, uh, you don't wish anything bad on anyone. But the way people have to be very mindful of how you treat someone. And so it took you a while to break three, break, okay, break three, break free from this person. But you did it. You had faith. You did it. Ever since then, you have a lot of stuff that's coming towards you. A lot of, a uh, uh, wheel is turning. Money may be owed to you, some settlement. You're happy. You got your money and you moved away from this person. OK, you you left. You shut the door. You back in control of your life. You shut the door. You said, I'm done. Miss positive thoughts, energy that I'm done. I cannot continue to let this person treat me this way. OK, yeah. See that a lot of pain here. Some of you could have been married to this person. A lot of pain. You went through a lot of pain. Maybe you was with this person 10 years. OK, you also went to counseling with this person that didn't do no good. You were married to this person. You're done. You, <laughs> yeah. Now, ever since you left, ever since you left, it took some time. Like I said right here, it took some time. But you're the queen. OK, it took some time. But you did it. You broke free. You broke free from this from this toxic marriage or this toxic situation or toxic relationship. You did it. You said, mm -mm, I am done. I am absolutely done. I am positive thoughts of energy. Aries way to go. Congratulations until next time.